So React is taking this data, this array of to-dos, and it is passing it through to this component function in order to render each of our to-do items. So with our main app component, we've got a couple different things here. First, we have what is called state, and state is how we manage the state of our user interface. So we're setting up state here where we have a set of to-dos, and then we're creating a new function here called set to-dos, which is how we actually update it, and we're setting the initial state to an empty array. So each one of these is a to-do item component that we created right here. And collectively, this data is being rendered from this array of to-dos. So React is taking this data, this array of to-dos, and it is passing it through to this component function in order to render each of our to-do items. And this state variable right here that is set to input, that corresponds to this, the thing that I'm actually typing into this text box. I have to manage that and keep track of that using React, and so that's what that state variable corresponds to.